Good afternoon, everybody. How are we doing? Okay, we get a game. Who's static? Is that you, Louise? And be static. How's that any better? Static all crackling. We had this last time, didn't we? That it was all crackling. I didn't understand why. Because the microphones are coming across all fine. It's fixed now. See, we don't do a thing, do we? It just it just, it just gets, resolves. It just, yeah. just gets better on its own. Oh my goodness. Sammy, hi, hi Sammy, first time on the chat. Sammy, hello, good day to Welcome. you. And okay, I'm so we're not crackling anymore, that's I'm good. clear. Oh, fab, okay. And can you hear Louise? Can you hear me? We will see. Oh, there's me again on there, that's that one, that's, that's, that's camera number three, please. But we're okay. Everybody, Madge, Banco, Victoria, Trevor, Thomas, The Mob, Innes, Romy, um, yeah, all you guys, how are you all doing? Good, good, good. Um, what did you think? So we're here today just to chat about all the glitters, last night's program. Uh, how is everybody, what did everybody think first of all of this We're still show? talking about my haircut, please. Oh, Mark. sorry. Thank you very much. <laughs> we're still, okay. We're still <laughs> talking about Louise's haircut. <laughs> Lovely haircut, yes. Mm. Mm. So I thought it was a great show last night. The, um, the, they're living true to their word. It is getting better and better each week. It's a shame that the, um, the excitement between all the, all, the, all the jewelers and the judges wasn't there at the start as well. But yeah, that was due to the editing um, I don't know why, why would they have done it, Lou? Any ideas why they would have done that? Done. Made it not as friend, not friendly and made the judges quite strict and stern. I, I don't know. I don't why, know. Why, why would there be a I reason? Don't... Is it to get people talking? People to come Maybe. on on the chat and go and blah, 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 this, that and the other? Everybody has said that they're, they're not like that in, in real life. Mm. And they're just really warm, lovely people. Everybody. Mm. Everybody. So said, maybe yeah. it's... A, it's just an editing thing to make him yeah. make him look like the evil at the beginning, but I don't think they looked evil. I think that's well, the well, not, no. <laughs> <laughs> but no, but no, but yeah, but but make him appear very stern and <laughs> yeah, but, like uh, the Gordon, but they like they weren't even like Gordon Ramsay, were they? Because no. he's just horrible, isn't he? But they were they were just objective, I suppose, weren't they? Mm. And yeah, so I don't know, really, don't know. Exactly, exactly. So the idea of today, we're just going to be showing the slides of um, the items that were made yesterday and having a little bit of a chat about what you thought and so forth. Uh, but we, we did have the pleasure of interviewing Sunny this morning. I thought that was, oh, when he went out, I thought, oh my gosh, we've got to interview him now. That's the first now. thing I said and Jasmine laughed, didn't she? I said, <laughs> oh no, we've got to interview him tomorrow. It's going to be really... Really embarrassing. Yeah. But he was really cool about it. He's such, such a lovely guy, wasn't he? He came just... across... Really exactly well. how he's such a cheeky, chappy, genuine, lovely, mm. warm person, isn't yeah. he? Yeah, and he's got mm. his bit of his, his, his North London accent as well, so yeah, he really comes really across lovely. really well. So we had a mm. really good chat, just over an hour, hour and a half this morning with Sunny. That was really good, did an interview, that'll be going live next week sometime. Mm. It was well, sad to see him go. Sad, yeah, yeah, but this is the thing, somebody had to go, didn't it? And this is, mm. this is the, mm, the whole crux of the show. Yeah. All right, should we have a chat? So I've seen uh, if I set diamond. Yeah, we're going to come on to the pieces now, aren't we? Yes, so, we are. Yes. Where uh, did you let's put go. them? Are they on desktop? They should be up on the screen. Fabulous. Are we starting with... Number one, please. Yeah. Slide number one. We have... Do it in the right voice now this week, please. Go do the Chris Whitty voice. Next slide, please. <laughs> Next slide, please. <laughs> Next slide, please. <laughs> Don't come. So Don't come. this is Dan's uh, geometric shape cuff. Um, I thought this was great. I thought there was a lot of work involved in this, uh, all the piercing out, all the cutting out, and also to make, was it four or five kite-shaped bezels mm. as well and set them. And I thought, do you know what? That was good. 
I was, I was, I'm in the now thinking he's never going to get all these done or they're going to be really rough. He's going to rush it, but they really went well. And I think looking at the picture there, yeah, damn mm -hmm. good job that was. Damn good, good job. Mm -hmm. Um, design wise, it is awkward to have a style. I think it is when when you do a profession like Dan, but I think his style's coming through. I think one week he's very geometric, the next week he's very floral, very swirly. Uh, so it's nice to see the two. But if I saw that, would I say that was Dan's? I don't know. I wouldn't. I wouldn't have thought so. But no, it was. A, it was a good piece though. Mm -hmm. I thought it was good. The the texturing, the liver sulfur really was good. Um, I thought it was a cracking bangle. What did you think, Lou? I loved it, yeah. Yeah? Really liked it. Mm. Anything you didn't like about it? No, I don't think there was. I mean, I probably I would have preferred it to have been deoxidized. Yeah. Well, not oxidized, no, yeah. yeah, personally, yeah, just but that's up. just my taste. Mm. Yeah, but then yeah. I suppose you haven't got time to do polishing. You mm. have to do something else, don't you? Which yeah. is what they, mm. but they, which is what they, fit they did the... with, yeah, they oh. designed within the time constraints. How about the texture? So... How about the texture on it? Yeah, textures. Yeah, it's, again, again, it does hide a multitude of sins, isn't it? It's the time, it? isn't it? Yeah. And I think that they're getting maybe better at working around the time now as time goes on, aren't they? Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And also knowing the workshop and knowing what's available and what tools are available to them. Um, it did look like a stained glass window, didn't it, as well? I thought it was really good. It did look like a stained glass window with the light shining through Yeah. as well. So yeah, it was really good. Did like that. What did everyone else think? Um, um, yep, the stained glass, leaded windows. Somebody said brighter stoves. I think it might have been Romy. Um, somebody said, yeah, brighter stones. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, more opaque. Uh, sorry, more transparent stones. Perhaps would have been better. Because we picked up, didn't we? They said, and I don't know whether this is just me being out of date, but they said that they said um, um, a precious and semi-precious stones, and I always thought that that classification had gone. Oh, mm, yeah, because. You can get a ruby which is pretty poor yes. in terms of the you know the quality, occlusions and yeah, the colour yeah, and the saturation, yeah. and so that's not going to be as valuable mm, exactly. as like a tourmaline or oh my gosh, tantalite, yeah. certainly. So yeah, yeah. So I thought that had gone out the window. So they so said, a bit they, surprised they said say. the precious stones. They said were the top. The big four. Big yeah. four, rubies, emeralds, diamonds, and sapphires. And then the non-precious. So I, I coloured stones is the current term. Mm, yeah. yeah. And I think that's that's right. I think it's really old fashions that is now considering. Um, yeah, it just made me think, am I... Yeah. Yeah, mine sounds a bit wrong. <laughs> so I don't know, it'd be interested to know what, what you guys but think. But I think you put it on, on one of the Facebook groups to talk about it, and they said, yeah, it is, it is mm. old-fashioned now. In the, is it the CI, CIJBO? The Blue Book. The Blue Book. Yeah. They don't like it now, saying the semi-precious and precious stones it's now. It's too subjective, isn't it's it? Too, yeah, mm. it, exactly. So that was an interesting thing, isn't mm. it? Yeah. Um, I thought it was, I always thought it was the big four. In theory, yes, it is, like, always the big four, but then you can have stones that are that are sort of semi-precious, that are more precious than the precious stones. Yeah, because there's the so much the variance clarity. In, the yeah. in the quality, and I know beauty's in the eye of the beholder, and you might mm. love a stone because of its colour, mm. and it might be heavily included, but then, yeah, exactly. yeah, it's just this, there can be so much difference. Yeah, absolutely, food for thought, isn't it, with that one? Mm. Uh, so what we got... I suppose these things go in and out of fashion, don't they? And yeah, but even things like tanzanite, that, that would be classed as a semi-precious, but that can be so expensive mm -hmm. and even even well yeah ruby can be more expensive anyway mm -hmm. um, so I, i'm gonna make it all about stones <laughs> i thought dan's piece is an impressive technique it just isn't pleasing on my eye at least my taste. no it course. can be very angular mm -hmm. um yeah it's very angular perhaps not everyone's taste but then not everything is is it no um real turquoise is exorbitant yeah because moldavite's gone through the roof isn't it because the, the mine's dried up They've you said, yes. back, yeah, they've they've exhausted it mm -hmm. at the moment, so it's um yeah. The price has gone up. Mm hmm. Mm, chromed up side is precious to me. Yeah, this is the thing, isn't it? It's all yeah. subject, but it's I think like, isn't I think it? there should be an industry industry standard. And I think there is no semi and semi precious now. Mm -hmm. uh, no precious and semi precious. It's like the salt and pepper. I mean, we could, we could talk about that. Quickly, <laughs> the about that but yeah, let's not let's not open that. All right, then. Of... Should we have the next? <laughs> Next uh, slide. If you say it to oh. me properly, then yeah. Um, next slide. Is that right? Please. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Next slide. Uh, next slide. Uh, we have the next slide, uh, which is, I'm going to try and flick around on here now. Uh, Tamara's watermelon cuff. 
Now this was quite unusual. It's asymmetric in its design, isn't it? Because mm -hmm. of the, she's just curved the one side. Um, Valentourmaline. It is gorgeous, isn't mm -hmm. it? Absolutely gorgeous. And I think, I think Sean picked up that the settings were quite rough. But again, we all have to think about time restraint, restraints so and the fact that they've got to make every bezel, they've got to make five bezels and solder them and set them and do all the decoration on the bangle within five hours. And so again, the time restraints are absolutely crazy still. Mm -hmm. um, I think Solange uh, picked up on the engraving. She said how that was good. She did that with the bird. She loved that. And they loved the fact that they tapered, that she tapered the... And I think you had to because yeah. it was a huge piece of silver, wasn't it? But it, it just added that bit of interest, didn't it? Yeah, Claire Stain loved the shape. Mm, it was like, do you know what yeah. it reminds me of? Wonder Woman! Yeah, <laughs> but I like that. Yeah, that <laughs> yeah. Was, from the early, not from the films, but from the early days when I used to watch it with my parents on a Saturday afternoon, eating my cheese on toast. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. okay. So yeah, it was good. It was asymmetric and it was, it was good. Um, what did um, what did Slan say? Power, like a power bangle, a very feminine power bangle. Yeah. Mm. And I thought that was that was that was really good. As I said, the watermelon tourmaline, brilliant stone. Um, oh, what else can we say about it? It's just great, wasn't it? Mm, it was great. It. Um, yeah, and the, the thing is, again, this is what pick, picked up on all the bangles, as far as I can see, is that that bangle, there's a lot going on in the centre, but nothing going on on the outside. That's what Solange picked up. But they picked she? that up on um, on Sunny's mm -hmm. and on Hugo's as well. But they, she didn't say much on this one, Because did of she? the tapering. The tapering, yeah. The tapering added that little bit more Yeah, it didn't interest. need it. She said they yeah. didn't need it yeah. because it had see, the tapering effect. Attention. Well done, You Louise. thought I was doing my nails. <laughs> <laughs> so I thought that was that was good. I did like that. Like to have seen some light behind the center stone. Yeah, we don't know whether it was a, a yeah. it was a closed back setting or whether it's an open back setting. We don't know. But mm. but being on the wrist, it would still be quite closed in, wouldn't it? Some light would. Yeah, I don't know. Yes, mm -hmm. time though, isn't it as well? But yeah, yeah, that would be lovely if you could have a bit of a window, which yeah, to mm. see some light through. Yeah. Okay. Good idea. Um, slide number three, please. I love this. This is Sunny's Night Sky Cuff. Now this is good. This is, we were chatting to Sunny about this today, weren't we? Mm. And we were saying this is typically Sunny. He doesn't, even though he may be given a standard piece of silver, he doesn't like it, does he? He wants to make that Just sheet. wants to bash it with a hammer, doesn't he? <laughs> 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 he, he did. Which is fab. Let me, let me move my camera over there. There we go, that's better. So, he likes to make the metal his own. If he's, if he's given a piece of metal the, the same as everybody else has got, he doesn't want it. He'll and after do speaking something to him different. this morning, his approach is fascinating, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, Which, yeah. And speaking to him this mm. morning, I was really interested. And now I want to go back and watch them again, knowing his thought processes. Yeah, and, his mindset. And I love his jewellery. Mm. And it's, now yeah. knowing how he gets it and what he's... Totally. Yeah, he's, I don't want to give too much away. No, we won't, we won't, but, we won't yeah. say too much, but we had a great interview talking about him and his style and everything. And looking at that piece now, you can see, yeah, definitely sunny within that. Obviously, it's that style, it's the thickness, it's the irregularity, it's the texture, it's the colour, it's that slight roughness. And again, I, th I think, I think um, Sean picked up on the, oh, there's roughness on those bezels. Well, yes, there is roughness on the bezel because that is the style of the piece, isn't it? Yeah. That is the pile, uh, that's the pile, the style of the bangle, there's roughness in it, there's texture in it, and the Bezels obviously have that as well. Yeah, it's beautiful. Mm. And again, they they said it wasn't um, there wasn't enough detail around the outside as I, well. I thought but, the design was so cohesive though. Yeah, and that's pretty much right across from here to here. And mm. I know Solange said it's a three dimensional object, admittedly, but it has the texture. It has it it, it peters out, doesn't it? Yeah. So uh, yeah, I thought it was a bit unfair. I think the comments were a little bit harsh. They were harsh. Yeah, yeah Sunny's bezels look great. They're, they're mm -hmm. not smooth. You know, the, the bezels aren't smooth and neat because the rest of the bangle isn't smooth and neat. You know, so mm -hmm. it's um, yeah, Julie. Yeah, they criticise Sunny's, yeah. but not Tamara's. Yeah, exactly right. But yeah, I think it's a fantastic effort. And when he was <laughs> when he had he had that. Um, 
like the brass wheel, and he was he was making the crucible out of the um, out of the ink, uh, out of the what's this thing called the charcoal block. I thought, oh my gosh, good on you, mate. But again, that took so much time, didn't it? Mm. Absolutely, so much time. But yeah, we love that. We love that. I think that one was my favourite. Yeah, think. you like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Now I just remembered he wanted smooth bezel, but I don't think that was in the brief. No, I don't think he was. No. Mm. The bezels lent to the rest of the bangle, which I, which I thought it really did well. I did love that, did love that. He should not have worn white pants. No. Yeah, exactly, that was <laughs> <laughs> the wrong day to wear white trousers, wasn't it? But yeah, it just came along, centre perfectly centre, I wondered if the judges would have judged differently. This is the thing, isn't it? Tell look at the centre stone. Yeah, it's slightly asymmetric, slightly off. Perhaps. But then the sky's not. Yeah, the sky's not even, is it? Yeah. yeah. So yeah, it's it's it, you it's just want, the design. you wonder what to do for the best. Is it best to make it completely central, equal, equal? Yeah, but whatever. Yeah, I thought mm. it was a brilliant design. I agree, Romeo. Brilliant I love design. Levis style, yeah. Brilliant design on that one. Great. And, uh, Louise, um, slide number four, please. This was gorgeous. Well. And this was lovely. Well, to be honest, I didn't like it. Didn't you? I I was very uh, no I liked but I thought I was very look at his bezels I, just the bezels were brilliant I thought I was very disappointed um... at at a few things here um, I felt that keeping the silver equal width all the way round I thought this made it this a little bit too clumpy could at have the back made... yeah you could have put waves. Yeah. Across the top. And I, I think, think Solange pointed out again, it's three dimensional. Mm. So why didn't he have those gold ribbons running the width of the bangle? Would that have been really labour intensive and time consuming mm. though? Well, well may have been, may have been, mm. but then he could have incorporated a bit more of a wavy edge on the outside yeah, to Romy's match, to match the waves the in the sand. To run east to west, yeah. Black uh, ideas. I felt really sorry for him last night because he's He's got brilliant feedback, yeah. and last night was not mm. a good night for him. But like. I think if you if, if you notice when he makes something, if it's small, neat, petite, amazing detail, mm. but when he has a large piece, he seems to panic, and he can't put those little fine small details on a huge piece. I, yeah. think, I think he struggles with that. When but he then has everyone's that. got what they like and what oh, they yeah. do, and yeah, so maybe he was just a little bit too much out of his comfort zone. Yeah, I, don't know. I mean, I liked yeah, it. I really liked it. Absolutely, mm. and um, the design of the, I said the ways that the, the bezels were spot on, absolutely gorgeous. Um, the texture looked pretty good. Yeah, um, and Vaughan Green thought it was the best one. Nice. You mm. can see a bit of bit of fire scale on that. You can just see the fire scale on that. On that. But there was fast scale on nearly every one. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah as well. That's yeah, just yeah, just, yeah. Just, just and again doing it with the fat. I think again, I think Sean picked up the fact that there was fast scale on um, on Dan's. Mm. And he said like another another twenty minutes, half an hour, could have got that off. But again, it's the time restraints, isn't it? Yeah, Penny. I wish we'd seen more of how he constructed it with the girls. Yeah, yeah. We keep saying that they they don't yeah. seem to be spending a lot of time, or certainly showing us what he's doing and. No, there's mm. not much time spent on him on a tall. Yeah, and oh. then it's suddenly he's done something amazing, and everyone's like, "Oh wow, brilliant!" Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but how, like, well, how, how did you get there? How did you do it? Yeah, they haven't, <laughs> yeah. they haven't actually showed it. Mm. So I thought it was quite strange. And there was a, um, a photograph, and I think I pointed it out to you. There's a photograph on um, on Durston. I think it was on Durston's Instagram page. Of, of of Sean going like this with his lovely cardio. Oh, it's, I'm going to get you. Yeah, get him a lovely cardio. Seven hundred pounds for a cardio. Yeah, yeah, yes, please. So, <laughs> and in the and in the background, you can see the jewelers. Yeah, benches, and you can see each bench has a cameraman, a boom, a producer. Everybody's except Hugo's. And I wonder why. Why you know, if there's a camera on Sunny, there's a sam camera, camera on Tamara's. Perhaps it was Tamara's, just that to But actually, moment. not nothing on Sunny. Uh, oh God, Hugo's. <laughs> Who's there? I'm thinking, mm. why not? Don't know. Don't know. Don't know. Past, I don't know. It, it, but it, it, is, it's just an observation. It could be just the way it's edited, yeah, which I we expect, know is. I expect it is. Yeah. Gets factored totally. in, but it's yeah. Yeah, it is a shame because I think he has such amazing ability in what he creates that it would be great to concentrate on him. Mm. Yeah. But as you say, it's camera work, isn't it? It is. It, it is. is. So is that all the bangles? That's the four bangles. I think so. Yeah. So I think that was really good. Really good. Maybe that's the roaming cameraman that does the judges and the one contestant. Yeah, could well mm. be. Um, 
which they would say tools down and then give them 30 minutes to polish their pieces. Yeah, that would be a good idea, wouldn't it? Madge, he was my favourite and I have bad luck. Oh, no, no. Madge. <laughs> um, <has> anyone... Oh. <laughs> really? I didn't see that. I didn't notice, I didn't that, notice that. Hi, Mark. Hey, Mark. Hi, Mark. Bully and Bully, Mark G? Yeah. Yay, Bully and Bully. Well done. I still got my... Uh... <laughs> my little lingots. Um, we'll have to go back to that. And if he has, I'll have a word with him. We haven't interviewed Dan yet. I'm going to have to add. tell him what you can and can't use. I'm not going to tell him. I'm just oh, going to ask. just leave him, I'm just going to ask him. I beg you, don't bring it up. I beg you. <laughs> I'll, ask, I'll ask Dan what possesses you to use an adjustable, so an adjustable frame. That. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, we'll get him drunk <laughs> on screen. <Yeah. laughs> How's that work? Oh, oh good, good, good. It doesn't good. take much. Yeah. Don't worry. We will ban you. <laughs> You oh can't dear, say dear. That. yeah, we won't go into it. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Mm. But if, if you mention the adjustable sword, but break. if you listened to <laughs> to the interview with um, Kim before this, she did actually mention that she took a couple of things in with her. Mm -hmm. um, so uh, I think she took her frame, her green lion saw frame, because I think she suffers from arthritis. And for her, that is a good frame that she can control. Mm. Um, so that's an answer to somebody's question. Ask them, can they take tools in? Mm. I think Kim answered that. I think they have a limited number. They oh, can't yeah. bring, you know, just wheel a whole sack truck in, but like one or two. There's a yeah. limit, isn't there? There is. Mm. I think there would be, yes. Yeah. Yes. Where you, when are you going to get some big boy tools down? <laughs> <laughs> Don't give him ideas, Dana. <laughs> All right, then. Should we have a look at the at the rings? Yes. The it, rings yes. were good, and I thought, oh, oh, my, oh, 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 if they chip it, if they crack it, that's a, that's a carrot. Mm. Not wasted because they can recut them, but can you imagine mm. under that much pressure mm. to do that and... On the telly. On the telly mm. and <laughs> within five hours. Oh. I know, I know. So we got us the first slide. The first slide we're going to go to is Dan's Hidden Star. I love the Hidden Star idea. I, did, I love things I like that. I got that on the top right of the picture as well. So there's Dan's hidden star. That was great, wasn't mm. it? I thought that was really good. I think he said he had half an hour to set all those diamonds. I don't think he would deny in half an hour, do you? That's brilliant if he did. That's mm. awesome work. That's like, what's that? One, six and six. That's like 12 in half an hour. What's that? Two minutes of stone? Five. Wow. Is he just got it on the one side? No, he got it on both sides. No, both sides, he? yeah. Wow, it's a very impressive work. I love the shank. I thought the shank was really good with that gentle swirl. Yeah. The contrast in styles now. Mm. Um, the claws, I thought, is absolutely brilliant. I thought it was really good. Yeah. Um, and what I quite liked the comment from Solange was she doesn't want anything to. She said, what's it? There's loads, there's loads of. What was her word? And there was loads of, of boring styles. Yes. I think there. she. It was a tough one. That. The thing is, with an engagement ring or a ring like that, you're going to wear it till the day you die, aren't you? Yes. So, I don't know. See, I wouldn't want anything that's going to date, and that's not going to date, is it? No, absolutely. It's, well, it it's... probably will. In you know, forty years' time, it'll be obviously a crossover. You might have an idea of a, a rough decade, <laughs> but I just think in terms of. Mm. I just think mm. for for a ring like that, the simpler the better, but then somebody else would say that's boring, and I suppose it is a design show, isn't it? Yeah, so, yeah. it is. But they, I, think, I, think, I think sometimes they're very conflicting within what they are asking for, and then what they're presented with, and they sort of criticise it, even though they're criticising what they were asked for in the beginning. Yeah, oh, and yeah, yeah, Penny's saying Solange was really dismissive of it, too generic. Mm. Yeah, and it was his wife's ring as well, he made it for his Yeah, wife. based on, on his wife, but then... Yeah. Uh, it, I don't Timeless think... style, exactly. Yeah, it's, yeah. Got to, it's got to stand the test of time, like durability-wise, but also yeah, yeah, yeah. Because because we we've had some comments on um, when 
um, the presenter mentioned to Slange, oh, you made your engagement ring. And she took it off. And with some people I know, you actually couldn't believe how awful it looked to them. But that's up to them, isn't it? That's I know, but them. I know what you mean. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, yeah. And Amco yeah. is saying the same, yeah. But then um, my taste is... Yeah. Really boring in her eyes, isn't it? So, but was it a salt? It looked like a salt and pepper diamond. Yeah, it would look, look like a natural, a natural uncut stone, didn't it? Because it? it had the pyramid sticking out of the top, yes. Mm, well, I'd love to know. Mm. Mm. So, yeah, it, it seems they, they say one thing, they get what they ask for, then they criticise it. So. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you're laughing at me. A bit frothy then, yeah. But it is true, isn't it? They, I want this, I want this. Well, I've given it to you. Nah, it's not this, it's not that. So there's no pleasing sometimes, is it? Okay. It was tomorrow's <laughs> nut ivory ringing girls. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Somebody made that. Um, a guy um, on Instagram over in Spain called Stephen Wright, he has actually had some of the... The ivory. Uh, to, to, Togonet? 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 Something like that. Yeah. He's, he's, he's made something out of it already. And that looks really nice on Instagram. Um, okay, so let us go on to. Do we have our next slide in the wheel? Yes. If you say it. Oh, next slide, please. Okay. <gasps> right then. So. I was just going, oh no, oh no, oh no. I thought it was just far too risky. I held my breath. Really thought it was too risky to do that. Mm. Absolutely, because uh, I don't know. It did exactly. Like, I agree with everything Sean said. It does look like. Oh well, yeah, an ancient Egyptian. Yeah, and it's beautiful. Yeah. But I just thought it's far too that, risky. Because well, you, yeah. you said it's not going to be filled, but then obviously a filled diamond would just that would be the end, wouldn't it? Yes. But a filled diamond, I don't think, would have a. A colour or a, a, a they, don't, they don't grade them, do they? I don't know. So mm, they do if they're if they're factory filled. They do they? Be, they could be factory filled. They have to be declared they're factory filled. Yeah, yeah, but they won't be graded in terms of the. I don't think they are anyway. Don't know colour. I don't think they. Mm. But yeah, I didn't expect it to work either. And when it cracked, I was like, oh my god, that's the end of it. When this when the, when the setting, setting cracked, and yeah. then yeah, I know it's just amazing she pulled it off because it is gorgeous. Mm. You see, it, I suppose the, the, the safest thing would have been to have melted the edge, eased the edge back, put the stone in, and then just hammered it over a little bit in various places to push a bit more metal over. That would have been the safest. She wouldn't have got that lovely effect, though, would she? Yeah. Do you think? Would it have been she quite so? She may have done, you see. I don't know. I don't know. But it did look good. And as say, Sean points out that the shank wasn't even on the one side, but then that's not right if it's an ancient piece, is it? Mm. It's, it's how it was made. Yeah. Um, and I thought it was really, I thought it was really good. It looked really nice. And that yeah. is typical tomorrow the style mm-hmm. with all the pieces that she's making. Yeah. Um, what's everyone saying about this? I haven't loved it, but not sure how to get connected with a client. It didn't, did it? There was nothing there. No, it's very niche, isn't it? I think you, yeah. yeah, if you like it, you love it and like it. Well, most people love it by the sound of it, but mm. it's, yeah, yeah, I love it. It, it is a distinctive. It's very hard to put a distinctive <laughs> style that you have with somebody else's personality as well. Mm. I think that's very hard to do. Yeah. Uh, Tamara's improving so much each time, and when it cracked, I was so afraid she wouldn't be able to finish it anymore. Yeah, yeah. Mm. They've had they is it magic? It's taken a while to for, uh, for for them to their styles to come through, and sometimes the pieces that they're making doesn't lend itself to their particular style, does it? But it's like we were saying this morning with Sunny. If you you choose um, a jeweler or a maker because you like that particular style, and then you you have them create you something based mm. on what you want in their style. Yes. But it's really hard, isn't it, to adapt your style or incorporate your style into something that that somebody else wants that may not be yeah and you're competing for the uh, yeah Yeah. it's it's, it's an alien concept isn't it it is it really is hard hard an octahedron diamond oh wow oh that's the The, the, stone in Solange's engagement is is, is, is that a natural diamond diamond. then is an octahedron diamond a natural diamond we shall see is that a a rough yes diamond rough is it cubic Mm mm-hmm now you can pick him up. Five hundred and forty-four dollars. Five hundred dollars on eBay. Two thousand three. I love the way the diamonds wow. are used. 
<laughs> you can buy a diamond on eBay, it's used. <laughs> yeah, so um, it seems like you can. It looks like it is a raw uncut diamond, isn't it? Yeah, rough octahedron. Yeah. It looked a little bit like that, didn't it? Yeah, like that a sort of. It's it. It's that 9.3 <laughs> but, but it does look good. It, it, this is the thing. It's all different styles, different, excuse the pun, facets of jewellery, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> the host, You're I wish. Like a style. Yeah, yeah. 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 Love the flip wheel pattern on the ball, band the band. Yes, the um, these little things here have, have, have really sort of made the appearance, haven't they, in these... Um, in the show because they are so good at hiding the surface and putting a brilliant texture on within a matter of minutes so yeah these wheels i'm sure i'm, I'm sure suppliers are going to sell out of those wheels now they're absolutely brilliant okay um may we have the next slide please jacqueline is saying oh, you're going to interview the judges oh no i uh, think so I, I who think... are we going to interview the judges mm. we mm, there was a th talk of sean mm. but we haven't heard back from the Publicist yet? Yeah. Get on so, to it, Louise. Yes, boss. Okay. <laughs> Next slide, please. Next slide, please. Do we have it in place? We do. What is the next slide? It Sunny's is Sunny's love twist. Sunny's love twist. Again, typical Sunny. This was really good. He did have problems with the twisting. It's really hard to put a nice even twist on a wire that's thicker and thinner in places. Um, yeah, I think this was really nice again. Mm. Uh, the three little balls on the side to, to denote for the, the, the man and woman and their little baby on the way. Um, that was good. And nice heavy bezel. Mm -hmm. And I like the, the, the way it, it was a bit of a cop out, wasn't it? Just putting the square graver in just to ease over the metal rather than sort of setting it with claws or a complete bezel. But it was a brilliant way that of setting it, I thought. Yeah. So perhaps not a cop out, Andrew. No, Andrew, it wasn't really a cop out. He actually used his used his brain, didn't he? Yeah, I thought it was really good. Great. And again, it's a typical study because you, if you go back to the bangle, you can see how the way he sets the stones in the bangle is that very very simple um, graver going into the to the metal, and that's why he's done on the bezel there because it is nice and thick, and he, he's, he's done it very well. Mm. Yeah, it's lovely. Yeah, this is the thing. Uh, M. Vaughan Green, very hard to resize later, later on. Oh yeah, in the, I didn't think about that. Yeah, mm. you'd have to try and match the pattern if you could. If you did cut it and put a piece in, you could try and get the twists. You can always tighten the twist on the ring just to get the pattern to match. So I'm sure, yes, it is possible, but not as easy as, say, Tamara's ring yeah. to resize. Mm. People are asking about the texturing wheel. Yeah, it is a frosting wheel, yeah. And you can get them in different... Um, different lengths as well. The lengths of the wires are different. That one's a shorter one. This is a longer one. They just produce a bit more of a coarse texture or a fine texture. So obviously one with thinner pins, finer texture than this one with thick pins. And they are very, very good. We use them quite often just for a bit of nice texture on say a wedge and band, something like that. Um, see anybody got anything else they want to say about Sunny's? Yeah, anything, twist? anybody else want to say something? I also quite like the diamonds that were set in the bezel as well. That picture doesn't show it up. A frothy wheel. <laughs> <laughs> very good. Um, yeah, I think it was very, I thought I did like it. It's mm -hmm. again, typical Sunny style, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Uh, next slide then, please. And we have Hugo's maple leaves. Now, from that picture, those maple leaves don't really show up, do they? It's not the best photo. Not is the it? best photo. Mm. Uh, top right hand claw, not right compared to all the others. It seems tends to be sticking out. It, it, it's higher on the right hand side than all mm. the rest. Um, but again, it, it's a brilliant piece of fine jewelry making isn't it nice lot of light coming through the stone yeah as well. he did did that that setting mm. so well nice and open very classic he did put the little claws as little talons on the top which i was I'm a, she, sean didn't pick up i thought that did would be, he do that i did well he didn't do that for sean though did he no but if, if but, he does his but if but if sean's signature style is like the talons i would have gone 
Lovely. Lovely. I love them. I lovely. Love uh, I, I love that. I love that. I do. I love that. That's I do. Lovely. That's lovely. lovely. <laughs> <laughs> you could have said it just like that. <laughs> but, um, you can't really see the, the the maple leaves either. On there. I'm not quite sure. Is, is he textured them? I'm not quite sure. And would they catch as well? Would they be sticking out this a little bit too far? They would catch. But then in one respect, it's a bit of a twist on something really traditional, isn't it? Yes. Which is... Oh, don't get me wrong. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. They, they, he Which is listening to the brief because he mm. went to, is it, to, to Canada for a few years. And there's, there's the maple leaves. Oh, I'm so sick. I didn't even... Yeah, Canada. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Louis. You were really doing your nails at that point. You weren't listening, were you? <laughs> yeah. No, yeah, but I, I just think it's a really clever twist on something which otherwise would have looked very, very... Very traditional. 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 And that's what Solange would not have liked. Exactly, she? yeah. She, mm -hmm. she would not have liked that. Yeah. Um, again, it's, it's typical Hugo. It's nice, fine, precise, yeah. neat, accurate, perfect, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Really. So, yeah, I loved yeah, it. I like it, yeah. And I also lovely. liked the way he was drilling into the claws as well. So the points... Mm -hmm. Don't get under any stress. The corners of the stone, so there's no stress on the corners, so there's not likely any chance of that stone chipping yeah. or cracking as well. So I thought, uh, yeah, Kate, love the wonky claw, glad it's not just me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, the talon look, I think all oh, this could have actually been picked up, couldn't it? Sean said the maple leaves were too obvious. Mm. Mm, yeah, it's, but then it, how could you get something that, is, that they can relate to into the ring as well? Well, it's a Canadian diamond, isn't it? That was true. It was so, a Canadian diamond, but yeah. yes. We didn't see a make the maple I'm Canadian. No, they just appeared, didn't they, Penny? The ring, yes. Yeah, the, the, the leaves. Yeah. He, drew, he drew it in his book. Yeah. Um, and then... They, did, they didn't show him solving them out, magic. cutting them out, <laughs> yeah. or anything at all, yeah. Actually, yeah, I missed that as well. They just, yeah, but they didn't materialise. Hardly. They, they, when he was putting the bits and pieces together and then he was lining up and getting the shank on, they did that. Um, yeah. Yeah, no, no, I agree. I agree, Amco, I think. Um, yeah. Yeah, Hugo says how to, to let in as much light as possible. It's just that one claw, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it, it, but again, it was absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Really wonky. It annoyed me that they didn't say anything about it. This is the thing that's what they may have done. They may have spent a lot more time judging the pieces, but obviously only cut out certain sections to fit in with the show. Yeah. But I, you can't cover everything within 30 seconds, can you? They need an after show so people can see them making these bits. <gasps> Maybe we could do that, go around and they cannot tell us to bugger off. <laughs> 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 but that, that would be a really good idea, wouldn't it? Would mm. be would be to, to, to then show all the bits that they didn't show and we could have a chat about it then, couldn't we? Mm. No, that'd be a brilliant idea. Yeah, we'll have good. to put that to, like, put that to like the Like Russell Brand on, what is it, Big Brother's Big Mouth? Yeah, well, I was, I was thinking more, <laughs> more like the Bake Off with, um, with what's his face. So I can't remember who does the latest Bake Off one now. <laughs> but that would be really good, wouldn't it? That would be really good. Yeah. Um, I would like to love to see the extended videos they show everything made. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah, thank you, Amco. Appreciate that. But yeah, an after show party would be really good. And mm -hmm. I would love to do that. Mm -hmm. I would love to go around and have a look. You know, and even if you did it whilst they were making it, but didn't show it on the show, but showed it on an after show, that would be really good, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh, come on, we had to put this idea to the producers, weren't we? <laughs> <laughs> Can I be a production sister? <laughs> with the outtakes too, yeah. yeah. Because we have enough of them, don't we? Well, can you imagine if someone walks in with like an adjustable? Oh, I couldn't. That's why they couldn't have you. I couldn't. <laughs> Sorry, <clears throat> certain few things are banned from the workshop. Adjustable saw frames. Can't... You can't enforce things like that, no, Andrew. No, I keep I'm telling only, you. I'm only joking. I'm only joking. I'm only joking. <laughs> <laughs> So is that it then? Is that it? I tell you what, everyone, approach 2020 and say, how about an after party? After show party, I mean, not after party party. But yeah, approach 2020 and say, and say, this would be a brilliant idea. Andrew and Louise do a... No, Andrew. Andrew and Louise <laughs> do a day after party and they know an awful lot about jewellery. And it wouldn't be a great idea if, if we could have an after show show 
I think that'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? Just chatting with the contestants one each week and then have a chat with them. Oh, go on, go on. If you're watching, if you're watching, suggest us. Please, 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 go, go, go. Oh, damn. All right, go on. It's getting frothy again now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. I think that's about it. I think anybody else want to say anything at all? I thought it was a really good one. Next week, do you know what they're making next week? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, what they're making next week. They are making, I can't remember the first one, but, <laughs> but they're making, it's a Marge, Marge Giat. No, I had to look this up. It's what people wear on their hair that comes down with a big ornament by here. Oh. And perhaps perhaps the, the chains coming round the front over the top with this big piece right in the front there. Go to go to go to no go to um go to um um, um all the glitters on there. Yeah. And uh, it'll say that. No, brilliant. Right hand side now, it'll tell you. It must say all that glitters. There we go. That's what they're making. No, you just missed it, Louise. Oh, go back. Right. <laughs> right hand side there. No, back, well, back up, 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 up there. The grand final, three finalists return to the workshop to battle it out. To win, they have to make two pieces this? of outstanding oh. jewellery, a pair of pearl earrings Ooh. that could be bestseller, and a bespoke mang tikka. A mang tikka. And I thought, I've got a tikka masala. Oh, Andrew. But I haven't heard of a mang tikka. <laughs> what? There, oh, it's one of those. Oh, fabulous. That is what they, I can't, I can't show you because I can't go on the wrong computer. But yeah, that Shall is I what do they it? have. Hang on, let that me is get what it. they have to make. Mm -mm. What you know? In this, we, in this, we haven't sorted out any themes for the question and answers just yet. We are so busy with this. Uh, with the interviews and this um, day after party with uh, all the glitters, we haven't managed to do anything yet regarding specific Q and A's just yet. There, Can't be it's like um, what we got. Is it like a bridal? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's that is what they have to make next week, and a pair of pearl earrings. I do love my pearls. You do love your pearls, but that would be amazing. But look at mm. that; they're going to make that. Wow. So that is what is on for the final next week. How do you pronounce it? I don't know. Man have a look. Mang mang mangatika? Perhaps best not, not to say just it. guess. So, no, I won't say it. But that's what they've got to make. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think that's about it. Oh, you, you, you're still finding out, Louise? You, no, I will have a look later. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So that's what they have to make next week, and that's going to be a bit, of, oh, a bit of a challenge. But I want to know why just five hours? Why can't they give them more time to do it? Because for the time that they're there, five hours isn't much, is it? What do you think? How long would you give them? I don't know. You'd have to give them a good six, seven hours, wouldn't you, for something that's I don't complicated? Think, I don't know. I, I, but would that be too much? It's not too a lot long? of time, but then, yeah, I don't think... I think if, because you, you are the world's worst. Thank you. Aren't you? No, but for the time, <laughs> mm -hmm. if somebody comes in, if, you, if you've got a deadline, you hate a deadline, oh, yeah. you can't stand. You were the, you, <laughs> if there's one thing you detest most, it's a deadline. Yeah, no. And I've noticed, and if, if, if I start nagging you, it goes back to the back of the mm. priorities list. Mm. And if a customer mm. comes in and asks, forget it. <laughs> and if we both ask you, then that's just it. Just consider it undone. So I think, I don't think any time would be enough. No, I suppose really. not. No. But for a competition, particularly, and you're... Yeah, if it's too much time, they're going to be going, mm, dilly-dallying, and they're going to be making, not making mistakes, and it doesn't then show them under pressure, does it? But at no. least with this way, it does put them under pressure, doesn't it? Yeah. Absolutely, yeah. Mm. Bake Off had two-day things for the showstoppers. Yeah, time is the biggest challenge. Totally agree. Polishing wasn't included. That would give them more time. Yeah, that, that would be a, quite a good idea, wouldn't it? Right, everyone tools down, you've got half an hour to polish or half an hour to, yeah. to, to finish a piece. I'm saying glad I'm not the only one who can't make anything on a deadline. <laughs> mm. It's like that, that ring that you were resetting for that customer and he said three weeks and I did say to the customer, don't be disappointed if it's not done in three weeks. <laughs> well, I said, but it'll be done, and it'll be done really well, but it might not be done in three weeks. Yeah. But when you get it back, it'll be perfect. It'll be perfect, yes. Yeah. Exactly, yeah. And she was like, that's fine then. <laughs> 
Um, yeah, let's see a jewelry with a stone for the third eye chakra hanging. The third eye, yeah. The covers the man, going man to, going oh. down to the third eye to cover that part. Of, I see. Oh, okay. Wow, okay. So there is a, quite a bit of. So is it to do with history? With the third? Oh, is it to do with? Uh, Jack, the third then. eye is it on the right oh, in the wow, middle of the forehead okay. yeah that's fascinating yeah oh we'll have to look out we'll Ooh, have to do, do, do a bit of, of um, research on this yep. yeah let they put this the red oh, okay well 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 oh that's fab okay yeah so that's what they're going to be making it and a pair of pearl earrings pearl earrings is going to be easy compared to doing that isn't it mm, do you think no. it depends on the brief doesn't it really yes. and the, yeah because obviously you can't use any heat nope Drilled cement it in place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll have to see. All right, everybody. That's it, Louise. I think so. Should we go home for a tea? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. Thank you so much for coming on this evening and staying with us for the last 45 minutes. Hope you've enjoyed the interview with Kim. We've got another interview coming up now with Nicola. That should be coming out. I'll try and get that out for Friday. Yeah. Friday, Saturday. What do you think? That's another good one. Isn't yeah, it? Nicholas mm -hmm. is another good interview. Really yeah. good interview. And it's all, they're all brilliant for different reasons, aren't they? Which is yeah, they good. each have their own way, mm -hmm. their own tools mm -hmm. they like, their own way that they start, mm -hmm. their own process. It's all completely different. Everyone is different so far. And it's making me realise that however you get to where you are, because that's one of the questions, isn't it? Is is and they're all so different, aren't they? Mm -hmm. How they where they started, how they yep. got to where they are. Yep. So there's no right way, is there? There's no right no. way or wrong way. And no. Yeah, just listening no. to them all makes me realise you've just got to do your own thing and yeah, yeah, yeah. and enjoy it along the way. Mm, absolutely. Mm. We can't say too much about what's going on because then it'll spoil some of the um, it'll spoil some of the interviews. But but Nicola was the one who did the what was the Japanese kintsugi? Uh, kintsugi. 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 Um, yeah. Yes. So, yeah. Yeah. We're going to be, we had a bit of a backlog because we had to get the interviews passed by um, by the publicist. But now they have. We're going to be releasing them, and hopefully we'll be releasing Nicola's now, and then we'll have Lee's and Sunny's um, next week. Mm. And we need Dan and Hugo's as well. Mm -hmm. So we need to get onto them and try and get them. But that's it. Everyone, thank you so much indeed. Anything you want to say, Louise? No, I don't think so. Thank you all for joining us. It's been a lovely time, lovely interview this morning. And it's we'll... been nice and relaxing, actually, because I've had a really busy day. It's been stressful. I've had Jason melting gold and making rings. Mm. you got my fingers, my fingers. Oh, look, how, look how shiny my nail. Look at my thumb. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Louisa. Yeah, I, don't know why, I don't know what happened there. Yes, so, um, it's, yeah, and I, I feel a lot more relaxed. A lot more relaxed. When we go home, I'll, we'll have a nice glass of wine tonight. Oh, lovely. That would be, yeah, nice, be nice. There's a bottle in the fridge it's already. Been a long day. Oh, is there? There is, yes. Nice pinots in the fridge oh, for us. Oh, you're cute, aren't you? Absolutely. You've got to take Jasmine to a boyfriend's. When we come back, tea will be on. But the um. oven will be on. Pizza will be in there and chips will be in there. It's going to be one of those teas tonight. <laughs> right. Um, I'm afraid I'll remember her for a breast mug. Yes. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> mm. All right, everyone. Take care. Have a lovely week. We will see you on Monday for our next Q&A. Yep. And um, look out for the next two um, interviews. The next one will be Nicola's, and the one after that will be Lee's. What on earth are we going to do? Well, when all this is over. I know. Just go back to I don't our... want it to end. <laughs> this, is, this is stressful enough getting... It takes me... It's like a 20-minute 20 a 20-minute interview. It takes me nearly two hours to edit. I know, but it's great fun. You love it. You've got to take Predictions, the... then, before you all go, who do you think is going to win? Who do you win? think is going to win? Who do you think Absolutely. is going to win? <gasps> we should have a little flutter. A little flutter. We should... Oh, 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 oh. Let's oh. have a competition. <laughs> Let's... Guess, yeah, sorry, I should have run this by you. <laughs> but we can, we can, we can do a competition, and okay. we can put everybody who was right in a. In, oh. Yeah. Okay. We have um, to do that on Monday, won't yeah, we? Yeah. Sorry, I'm being like you know, I'm coming up with ideas and going. <laughs> ooh, 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 let's do it. Minute, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Perhaps we'll do a competition. Yes. And whoever gets, whoever guesses right, because it is a guess, isn't it? Could be anybody. It is. Yeah, we don't know. Will win. We don't know. Their membership. Yeah, they've all, everyone has been very, very good, haven't they? Mm. And not saying anything and not letting the cat out of the bag yeah. or anything. We, we just talk, we just get them so relaxed, we talk about all sorts of things, but none of them have They're said slipped very, up or anything yeah. at all. And we haven't tried, that makes it sound oh, like no, 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 we, we, we haven't, we haven't tried, no. but yeah. Mm. No. But no, but it's, they're very good. So we got Tamara, Hugo, Dan, 
It's Dan or Tamara. It could, it could be anyone, couldn't it? It's, <sighs> you know, I, it's I thought, too hard to call. I thought at the beginning Tamara was not producing what she wanted to produce. And now, I think the last couple of things that she's produced, the Bangle the Ring and the Locket, what was last week? The uh, Alternative Materials. The, no. I can't remember which one it was, was now. Last week. But yeah, I thought she Beatles. Romy, no, that was the week yeah, before, wasn't you it? got you got like a a 30-30 chance <laughs> of, to be honest <laughs> yeah. there, haven't you? Do you they they are all, all winners. winners. Yeah, they are. And do you know what? The the people we've interviewed so far, they've all taken every single person has taken so much from the experience, haven't they? Without spoiling or saying too much, they they just yeah, haven't they? It's just been such a positive. They have. They're right from the moment they've all bonded, they all got on well with each other. Yeah. They've all learned. It's a heck of an experience. Highly recommended. And you, you, you know, you you look at it and you think and and I don't know. It's you know, again, you can't let too much add back of all the interviews we've been doing. Yeah. But it seems like they all the people so far, can I say all the people so far have not actually wanted to enter themselves, have yeah. they? None We're getting of... chopsy now, aren't we? I'm We're yeah. saying too right. much. That's right, we yeah. will see you Monday. <laughs> we will see you Monday for the next Q&A. Don't forget. Look out for a competition because um, I'm planning one now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look out for a competition. I don't know how we're going to do it. We're going to do it on Facebook. We'll mention it. Perhaps we'll put a little, little, little film up or something like that. Perhaps, perhaps we'll, Monday. Perhaps Monday. And can... perhaps we'll do a little film. Let's do it Monday then. We'll put something out Monday on the live. We need to do it beforehand because Tuesday comes out live. Look out for the next. Yeah, it, look Monday's at, before Tuesday, darling, isn't it? Yeah, that only because Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Literally, literally, uh, literally uh, yeah, you know how the days of the week, <laughs> but it only gives people twenty-four <laughs> hours to enter the competition. Okay, which isn't long enough. So I think we need to do it tonight. We'll get it on Facebook tonight. We'll get it on Instagram tonight. Okay. We will put it within the trailer for the next premiere, which will okay. be Friday. Yeah. So then people got. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday to enter. On Monday, we'll mention it as well. Let's okay. try and get as many people in on this. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Think yeah. So? Cool, cool, cool. And as a bit like a math teacher, I uh, used to have get him talking about the Second World War on me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's just like that, Penny. He's so I'll, easy to distract. Ask Andy another question. He can keep me here forever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and I would. Oh, 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 yes, oh, yes. Oh, go, I've got go, news. Go. The prize schedule is on Facebook. Oh, yes. Yeah, so at the bench members now have a chance to win um, 12 chances a year to win Durston goodies and this GRS and Fordham. Um, well. So, yeah, if you're on Facebook, have a little look. Um, if not, then I think we're probably going to try and get an email out to newsletter out in the next yes. few days, probably the next week, Yeah. if I'm realistic. <laughs> um, but it, 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 what have we got? We've got... Bangle forming die got, kit. Yeah, bangle forming die um, set, disc cutter, mm -hmm. doming set, soldering station, um, GRS bench made, GRS micro block, Fordham SR pendant motor. Uh, it's, it's like like generation game, this isn't it? Generation yeah. game. Oh, oh, got, oh, peddly oh, oh. toy. Disc cutter. I'm just looking at disc cutter. Doming, yeah, yeah. Doming, doming set, disc cutter. The oh, punch. I can't remember. Oh, bangle forming die set. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. yep. Oh, that's a there's lots. Yeah, so there's, there's lots. So there's what basically 12 prizes, and they're really good prizes. They're big prizes. Um, and all you have to do is be a member. Be a paid, a paid up member. member. If you were a paid up the member, bench. then you would, you'd need do nothing. We're not asking you to lift a finger. All you have to do is be a member, a paid member, and you will be automatically entered, and you will be contacted. Bondu set. Yeah, yeah. I'd like that. <laughs> well, fondue set. Yeah, yeah. I could prefer that. So fondue the, um, set, cuddly the toy, or like um, le leather driving gloves. Um, um, <laughs> yeah. yeah. And bully special prize. <laughs> no, no, no. That's not the generation no, I... game. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's time to go. <laughs> Look, it's time to go. Yes, yeah, so you don't have to do anything. You, we will just contact you if you win, and then you get yeah. shipped your prize. Yeah. So if you, so yeah. So to, just to recap. 12 prizes, mm -hmm. total of three and a half thousand pounds. Every month you will have a choice of two prizes of equal sort of value because you may like not want a, a dome set, but you have, you know, you've got one, you want a disc cutter. So you've got every month chance of winning two prizes. Oh yeah, I see, I get it now, yeah, yeah. Yep, three and a half thousand pounds worth, Durston products, GRS products, Fordham products as well. We're not asking you to enter competitions, to post, to share, 
to do anything at all or to do this, that and the other, make make rings, make bangles, do drawings, nothing like that. Everyone's lives are busy enough. Yes. Yeah, we've all included. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> so that is all you got to do. Be a paid up member. You'll go into a drawer. We'll push a button. One winner will come out. If that person doesn't collect that particular item, not collect it, but claim. Claim. Just contact thank us. You. Yeah. Claim that particular Don't item. Don't come to that South month. Wales if there's no need. We'll no, no, no. <laughs> yeah. um, it'll roll over to next month, which would mean there'll be two prizes available to win and so forth. So we need to do a sheet of terms and conditions. There will be terms and conditions. Yeah. The terms and conditions are already on at the bench. Great. For the terms and conditions that when we have the competitions on YouTube. Great. So we should link all that. We'll have a good old chat tomorrow because we've got Lee working with us tomorrow. Yay! Lee, we had the right laugh. Oh, didn't we last Thursday? Yeah, Lee. Yeah. Lee is an awesome, awesome laugh. So Lee will be with us tomorrow. Um, and works working away. And, and he does, work, talented, does yeah. work hard. He works hard and mm -hmm. laughs hard as well. Uh, set a date for the next 24 hour life. Oh, I'm close. <laughs> <laughs> Louise, you said, what are we going to do when all this is over? We have a 12 hour to plan. Come Silly on. me. <laughs> um, okay. His and hers towels. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like sheepskin coat, I seem to remember as well. Wasn't that one of the prizes? Don't know, don't know. Um, uh, one of those, um, those, those. Fridge freezer. Um, no, the feet, the um, feet massager. Yeah. Feet massager. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Shaver, mm, yeah. electric toothbrush. Yeah. Oh, if only, if Just, only. Uh, Football. Maker. Yeah, got yogurt maker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Yeah, why do you both sleep? Do you know what? I feel sleep's overrated. I sleep when I'm dead. That's, that's, you took the words <laughs> right out of my mouth. I was going to say sleep is so overrated. What a waste of time sleep is. It doesn't matter how much we could actually get done in those eight hours that we're asleep. <sighs> okay, let's Tried go. Try to home. trick you into doing the stream for 24 hours. Ah, yeah. God, can you imagine that? It's tough enough doing 12. It takes me nearly 12 you know, hours I to cool the down. 12 hours after. fly by. The last, the last, the two that we've done have just been. Mm. Because we know we're going to do it. Well, we think oh, we're going we to do it. Some, for... We got some ideas for this next 12 hours, haven't we? I'm not saying anything. I can't Shh. open Louise. I no, can't. Can. I think we need to go now. That's all we've got time for today. <laughs> we've got some awesome ideas for the next 12 hours. Stop being topsy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Dana, they gave them nine carrot and I thought that was completely wrong because everyone loves a bit of 18 carrot, don't they? Yeah. Yes, you're quite right. Okay, should we go? Okay. I, before, I, before I let anything too much out the bag, that's the cat usually. Yeah. Now the cat will come out the bag and then, yeah, everyone, say goodnight, Louise. Good <laughs> we will see you all on Monday for the next Q&A 4pm. And don't forget the day after party on the Wednesday. Don't forget to look out for Nicola's, Nicola Lily's, that's it, uh, from Nicola Lily's uh, premiere on Friday. And we've got Lee's coming out then at the beginning of the following week and Sunny's then later on that week as well. So good night. We will see you all Monday. Take care. Fade to black. <laughs>